Well, I think when we first heard about Omicron, it was very clear that people said that they would need a couple of weeks before they would know the full impact of its transmissibility and the effectiveness of the vaccine. So we haven't got those uh, details as yet. But I think um, just to be uh, positive, because it's a month for being positive or in the season of hope, uh, I think it's very important today to also say how good it is that this antiviral pill, uh, which has been um, uh, allowed to go ahead by the MHRA, the people who decide whether a a drug can go through uh, the the country, has been allowed. So that means that if someone does take COVID, that they can very quickly get this uh, pill. It's an antiviral pill, um, Nigel, and that then can help them stay out of hospital. I think that's something that we should celebrate this morning. I understand from listening to some experts this morning that that has to be given to the patient quite quickly after they get COVID. And then if they take that, it helps them to stay out of hospital. I think that's really good news. But I also have to say that in terms of the government response, I think government are now saying, look, personal responsibility is very important here too. We all have a responsibility to look after ourselves. Uh, And I would hope to see more of an emphasis on personal responsibility. We are all should protect ourselves from uh, the Omicron variant or COVID or whatever else is out there uh, instead of having this sort of blanket approach, uh, which, frankly, when I look at what happens and what is happening in Germany and Austria, oh. fills me with a little dread, I have to say. 